What's up, Sycamore? Happy Terrific Tuesday, and welcome to this episode of Sycamore Junior High Aviator Airways Daily Video Announcements. Today is August 27th. Hi, I'm Carter. And hello, I'm Ada. Source Sycamore with respect, responsibility, and safety, and creative problem solving. It is time now to be respectful and stand with our fellow aviators and place our hands over our hearts and say the Pledge of Allegiance together. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Thank you all and please be seated. It's Clubs and Activities announcement sign. SSC Sycamore Singing Company. Sycamore Singing Company's first audition clinic is today after school. That's 3.15 to 4.45 p.m in the junior high choir room, room 1153. Here's the link for the SSC audition materials that will be found in the Sycamore Singing Company canvas page. You can access it so you can access it starting today, August 27th, using this link. Email Mr. Callahan or Ms. Savage if you have any questions. Next up. Junior High Beach Bash. Registration and getting donations for the Junior High Beach Bash celebration on September 20th is here. Lily and C won last week and there, there will be three winners drawn this week. So make sure to get registered and get your donations in to be eligible with, for this week's drawing. The goal is to raise $50,000 and the 7th graders have almost double the 8th graders donations. Wow 7th graders, keep up the great work. Again, here's the QR code. Uh, to pledge start to get registered and start getting your donations. Be informed. Check those emails every day. Be a responsible young adult and make this a great place to work. Now over to our other crew for more announcements. Hi, I'm Lily. And I'm Casey here with some additional clubs and activities announcements. Hey, are you excited about the high school home football game this Friday? Yes, I am. Do you plan to go? Yes, but we have to follow Mr. Stern's guidelines. He mentioned yesterday, and the high school has the same expectations. In fact, the entire district has the same expectations to treat others with respect and follow our PBIS guidelines. Check out this diagram the high school shared with us regarding where we are permitted to hang out at the game on Friday, along with this message from the high school, including their expectations. It says, We hope that all of our junior high and greeny students are excited for the 2024-2025 football season. When you attend games, please keep in mind the following expectations. Please avoid the red zones you see on this map. The green zones are areas where you are permitted. Awesome! So we're allowed here in the green zones? Oh, this next one. It looks like I better leave my backpack at home or my parents' car. It says no backpacks are permitted at the game. It's good to know so I don't get up to the gate in my backpack and find out I can't get in with it. Look at this one. We can't leave and return to the game either. It says you may not leave and return back to the game. So I guess if you leave the game, you're done and you can't re-enter. Yep, once you leave, you leave. The next one says no football or any type of gameplay, no horseplay or climbing on the fences. Okay, so don't bring any of this stuff either. Finally, it says the football game is an extension of the classroom. School discipline could occur if there is a violation of the code of conduct. Well, it looks like we need to practice our positive PBIS behavior at every school event, including Friday night football games. Sounds good to me. That way I can enjoy watching the game with my friends and cheer with all of the Aviator Nation safely and responsibly. Yes! Go, Go Aves. Aves! Okay, what do we have next? Partners Club. Check out this flyer for the Partners Club. Mark your calendar for the first meeting to start October 2nd with Miss Lisa in room 1260. It's also known as Mr. Shomo's room. Partners Club will continue to meet the first Wednesday of each month. With any questions, contact Miss Lisa at crispl at sycamoreschools.org. That's all we have today. Back to our crew. Thanks, crew. Again, we'll have a special schedule tomorrow and Wednesday. See here, we test in the morning within our testing locations from 8.10 to 10.26 a.m. Then go to bell one, and then second bell, 
then fifth bell. Basically, we swap third and fifth bells. Makes sense. Thanks. Now, our now a message from our from our counselors. The deadline for scheduled change requests is today, Tuesday, August twenty seventh. You can email your counselor or stop by the counseling office to discuss potential potential changes. If you'd like to share something new for C on the video announcements, please reach out to a crew member or email Ms. Jarvis to set up a meeting with a crew member. Now over to our flight flight crew for a special announcement. I'm Dylan and I'm Delaney and we're here with the flight crew. The flight crew's mission is to build a school environment where all students wake up inspired to learn, feel safe, and go home feeling fulfilled at the end of the day. Flight crew is a smaller club that helps make the school better for students. There will be an application so that you can join, but there will be more info on that later. If you have any questions, email Mr. Rodriguez at rodriguezd at sycamoreschools.org. Thank you. Thanks, flight crew. Next, Next up, up, birthdays. Happy birthday to Zachary B. Laura De S. Jonathan S. And just celebrating you a special day. What does a baby computer call his mother father? I don't know what. Data. <laughs> that, that was that was funny. <laughs> well, that's all we have for today. Enjoy your day, make marvelous choices, open your mind to new learning and meet a new friend. And, and go, go Waves!